joining me on my program once again. I appreciate you wherever you are joining me from. I say good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Accept my greeting according to your time zone. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please kindly subscribe to my channel. Click the notification bell so that you'll be notified each time I upload a video. You can be among the first to receive it. Then go to the comment section at all time. Leave your comment, drop your contribution. If you have suggestions, make it out there. If you have any criticism, put it down on the comment section. It will make us to get better. Presenting you a better program. Thank you so much. And they know it. They know if it. They, have choice, they, things, they will have seen the last information that came from us in Nandekano. At least they have seen it clearly now. Nah, they have this, seen this it clearly. New, they have this seen it clearly. That one doesn't have anything to do with them. This new message, that one boss Madreno. They have seen it clearly. And all of them now, they are running Heather's they, they They are confused. <laughs> they are very confused now. <laughs> they are well, confused. Well, 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 some of them are, are diverting to there. Some of them will become a comedian very soon. There's one I, there's one I hear, I see, I read. Simon has a jack. Bannon has a jack. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Mm. I said yes. Let me hijack her because who, when you show you how stupid you are, somebody will slap you to resent your brand. And the same one is now slapping them like even say the, the, their brand cannot be reset anymore because all this <laughs> slap, all this slap, Simon slapped them till today. Their brand cannot be reset. Cannot. What did they do now? They go bring all, 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 all this in. Like that one, uh, Ejuro Bakadu, carry come at that time. Yeah. My brother, the, all their strategy has finished. Did they go all those and ones, bring, what did all, they those ones you are calling, all those ones you are calling their name, I don't even know that they exist. Those kind of people, I don't even, I don't even brother, look I, at them because it, it, I don't even know I that they this, Why I call this name is that because this thing has been far back where they use attack Simon. Hmm. So since their strategy has, strategy has finished, they went back and be bringing oh <laughs> 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 because they don't have any other thing to use that black bed guy. They go, go back to bring oh oh teams, oh oh tactics where they have already used. Yeah. Hey, my brother, I thank God for you guys. Yo. Simon has said, you guys said make, us, make us to still be relevant today. If not, if not, if not, everything about Biafra, I got to have, you don't give me zero. Zero. Exactly. Zero, my brother. Everything about Biafra Club, be zero. That's why I want, anything I don't listen to you guys, even if he sleep, they carry me. Uh, uh, my brother, I go put that on him, carry the phone, put that for my ear side. Make the sleep, they carry me. That's make, make my spirit, they listen to that. <laughs> it is well, yes, my brother. Bro Thank you so much. Thank you, my brother. God bless you. Thank God you bless so all of you, all the media warriors. Bless you too. That stand still. And let not know that too. We can never, 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 never stop. God bless, bless you your family. Bless, bless your wife. You because if your family did not stand with you, my brother, he can never. He can never. He can never. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so much, my brother. Thank you. I appreciate you. Thank you so much for your contribution. I appreciate you. You've done very well. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. So, so fellow beer friends that is watching any place you are watching from, I want you to sit up. Sit up. Sit up. Today it has become clear. All you need to do, you don't need to listen to blackmail or propaganda. All those voice messages are sending to you in your DM. All those secret messages they are sending to you. You don't need to pay attention to it. All you need to do is to use your common sense. Apply your common sense to every single voicemail they send to you. Apply your common sense. This is exactly the same thing Mazin Nandekan was facing. The same attack Mazin Nandekan was facing. That is the same thing Mazin Samuel was facing today. The exact attack. And 
it has become so open now because the people who were attacking Mazin Nande can even while they were with him, who claimed to surround him, they claim to be they claim to be followers of Mazin Nande, but they are attacking him. That was why then it was so difficult for Mazin Nande to make, make a move. Mazin Nande can kept in on the ground a very solid template to get Biafra, a very solid template. Mazin Nande can kept on the ground to get Biafra. We would have gotten Biafra a long, long time ago, but the, the People who surrounded Mazen Nandekano, who placed themselves in a position, we are people who never wanted us to have Biafra. They were people who are busy for their own personal interests. And they fought Mazen Nandekano. They blackmailed Mazen Nandekano. The same way they blackmailed Mazen Nandekano. Remember the case of transmitter? They blackmailed Mazen Nandekano. When Mazen Nandekano was talking about transmitter, to put transmitter. They blackmailed Mazen Nandekano that he did it. He stole money. He scammed. And even in that transmitter it was still the same people the same people who stole the money of the transmitter they were the same people who were who went and back and began to blackmail Mazen Nandekano and when Mazen Nandekano finally gave up where the transmitter is they still planned again the same people who Mazen Nandekano was fighting for still planned to go and steal the transmitter behind him and by the way this transmitter transmitter you are hearing today it is the same thing that Mazen Simon Epa is sitting on Finland and installing in the whole of Biafra land how much does it cost? This, this same thing, they were stealing money from Mazen Nandekano. Different agents from, from different angles. Position, the different angles, stealing money from IPOB. Stealing money from Mazen Nandekano. This same transmitter issue. Mazen Samoneka have established voice of Biafra. In voice of Biafra now that is circulating in the whole of Biafra land. Almost circulating in the whole of Biafra land. It was done and superheated by Mazen Samoneka. And people were doing it. On their own, being sponsored by individual, it didn't cost as much as it cost when you were talking about the issue of Radio Biafra. But people, the same people, Biafra people, the same individuals, all these criminals who call themselves members of the Department of Sabotua, they were the same people who blackmail Mazen Nandikan, stole money from him. And that is what they want to do to Mazen Samanepa today. And when they see that Mazen Samanepa have learned from the previous mistake, Mazen Samanepa. Is not somebody you will go and scam. When they saw that there's no way, there's no way at all for them to scam as someone ever, they begin to push their propaganda. They began to push their blackmail against as someone ever. They have used different kinds of things to scam as someone ever. They couldn't succeed. They passed through to scam as Honor Blazoka. Honor Blazoka stood her ground sincerely. Honor Blazoka. A woman who is working to secure your life and my life. A woman who is diligently pursuing the freedom of the people. A woman who is diligently handling issues that has to do with Biafra. Diligently. You blackmail her. You call her name. You say all manner of derogatory things against her. Even when you know that these are lies. Just to make yourself, just to make, just to, just to be able to, when you see that you cannot be able to penetrate to scam her, when you see that you cannot be able to penetrate to scam Honor uh, Brazoka or Mazen Sam when you couldn't penetrate, you begin to build propaganda around it. These are the people who were stealing money from Mazen Nandekano. The same thing they did to Mazen Nandekano. The same thing they exactly did to Mazen Nandekano from different angles. They will come and they will say they want to go and they want to go and get a get a what do they call it buy a transmitter. Mazen Nandekan will release money to them. They will squander the money and come back to accuse him. They will take the money. They come back to accuse him. They will take money. They want to go and bring a resolution. They want to go and bring a speaker. They want to sponsor a speaker. They will take the money. They will come back and accuse Mazen Nandekan. The same people who steal the money will still come back and accuse Mazen Nandekan. That is what they want to do to Mazen Samanepa. And Mother Bazooka. Today, the strategy they are using for Master Simon Eba and Mother Bazooka is our men on the ground. The new language, the new language of scamming is men on the ground. That is the new language of scamming. Every one of them you hear from their mouth says, Our men on the ground is not being fed well. Our men on the ground is not treated well. Our men on the ground is not taken care of. Men on the ground. Men... The new scamming language, the new scam is men on the ground. And our our spokesperson, Master Simon Eba, very, very awake. You can't scam him with that language. He has learned a lot 
from the previous mistake. Honorable Azoka, I've learned a lot from the previous mistake. And that is why they are standing their ground. No matter where you bring your propaganda and blackmail from, you cannot penetrate. You form your own men on the ground. You bring your court group and you name them men on the ground. There are many men on the ground. But we know the people we are talking about. The only men on the ground that is standing for Biafra people are known by our spokesperson, Master Simon Ekwa and Honorable Azoka. They know the channel to reach them. The people who are the ESN, the ESN of Mazen Nandekano, the ESN established by Mazen Nandekano to secure Biafran people. They know the channel to reach to Mazen Nandekano, Mazen Simon Ekwa and Honorable Azoka. So so if you see anybody sending you any blackmail message of men on the ground, men on the ground, men on the ground, these people are a bunch of scammers. Bunch of scammers who are lining up to steal. They want to steal from Biafran people. They want to steal the hard-earned money that Biafran people have been contributing to protect the ESN and protect our land, to secure ESN and provide for them what they need to defend us. They want to scam it. I don't know why people will not stop. The same way they scam, even our eternal leader, Dim Odubu gave out money to go and purchase ammunition during the Civil War. Our eternal leader, Dim Odubu gave out money to go and purchase ammunition during the Civil War. Somebody escaped with the money. They ran away with the money. In the era of Mazen Nandekano, so many extortion from right, left, and center. People claiming to do this and do that when the money is released, you, you won't see them anymore. Now, in the era of Mazda, they have come again. When they are not succeeding, they go with blackmail. Their blackmail today is men on the ground. Every you go to, you'll be sending voice message and to people to talk men on the ground, men on the ground. The idiot that's talking men on the ground, you are not part of the autopilot. You are not a part of the administration of autopilot. You are not anywhere in the administration. What business do you have with the security of Biafra land? What business do you have with the men on the ground that are working with the autopiloted IPOB? What business do you have? You are not in any administrative gathering. You're not part of it. You are not part of it. So what the hell do you are you looking for? If not to sabotage them. If not to sabotage them. Every man on the ground, legitimate man on the ground, have a source of reaching out to Madame Azoka. Reaching out to Master Simon, they know their source. They know their source. So when you see all these idiots popping out from one angle or the other, don't give your ears to them. These are cheap blackmailers and they will never succeed. The state we are now, I can tell you, we are in Biafra now, securing our land. We don't have time to, to begin to look at idiots. We are in Biafra. Biafra land, securing our territory. That is what we are doing today. That is the state we are. Securing Biafra land. And if you know what is good for you, if you are a Biafra, seeing what is happening in Lagos today, you must begin to think of how to secure your land. Not to blackmail. Not to think of how to extort money from your brothers. No. Do not think of extortion. Begin to think of how to secure your land. Seeing what is happening in Lagos today, begin to think of how to prepare your land. Everything that you need to know today, you know it. Every information you know today is available. If you decide to go the other way around, you have yourself to blame. We have no explanation to make to anybody. Whatever action you take today, whatever direction you take, you have to face it. Be responsible for your actions. You must be held responsible for any action you take. It is not time to beg. 2022 has been a lot of defense. Explanation and begging. In 2023, we are in Biafra protecting our territories and res restoring our Biafra land. That is what we are in today. It is no longer time to begin to explain to any idiot or anyway. I appreciate everybody who have listened to this broadcast. Please share this broadcast to everybody so that people who were not able to come in can come in and listen and hear the word. You cannot eat your cake and have it. Have it at the back of your mind. The Biafra people. We are fighting for our own land. We are not fighting to occupy people's land. We are not fighting to take away people's land. We are not fighting to overpower anybody. We are fighting to restore our own land. That is where we are concerned. We don't settle as strangers in people's place. We travel a lot, but after traveling, we must return home. So if you're one of 
those who think that we are fighting for your land take over your land that you take over your land you're talking about is a waste of time you better channel your energy on how to defend yourself if, if you're one of those who is thinking that the biafrans mainly the Ibu biafrans are coming to take over your land stop that nonsense and channel your energy in securing your own land because the real people who want to take your land are distracting you and when it begins to happen you, you might not have a place to hold on hold, hold on to and protect everybody that have participated in this broadcast today wherever you have come from to participate in the program i say may shukuo kukabe and guide and protect you secure you guide you be with you every day of your life don't get distracted be focused think on how to defend yourself that is where we are every indigenous tribe including our Udua brothers focus on how to defend your land and protect your land the Biafran people, the Igbo people, has no business with your land. We are there for business. After business, we return home. And you cannot have your cake and have it. There's no way you can sell a land for us for business and you want to take it back. You don't. You can't. And you will not. That land and that location remains Yoruba land. It remains Southwest Yoruba land. It is your land. We didn't steal it. We didn't fight for it. We are not intending to steal it. What we are doing is business. We buy it, we invest on it, we make it fertile, we pay tax, we develop it. That is what we do. But at the same time, time has come for us to go our own home and develop our land. That is why we are fighting for Biafra. That is why we are asking for the disintegration of the zoo. So that we can be able to go to any place we want to go. Just as we are in London, we are in the US, we are in Japan, in so many other places. We go with our passport, invest, pay our tax and return back home. Only thing that is making you feel as if we want to take off your land is because you are in a contraption. It is because you are in a contraption. That is why you are feeling that the Igbos want to take over your land. Nobody wants to take over your land. And nobody can. Chukwo Kukabiyama have gave you, given you that land as a position where you are. It is a place you are. Nobody can change it. Nobody can change it. But let me tell you, since we are there doing business, anybody that is doing business, not only the Igbos, anybody that they have invested in that they're doing, they, just like as those of us who are in abroad in Western world, we pay tax and we participate in the election, we vote. We pay tax and we vote. Voting and paying of tax is the right of those, whether a visitor or a stranger. Well, whoever you, they, it is their right. You can't deny it to anybody. Paying tax and voting is not stealing your land. They are only developing and maintaining your land. Get that into your skull. And it is so sad that many people who are peddling this line of argument are people, people who claim to be educated and living abroad. May Chukwu Kagame have mercy on all of you. Our only focus is to restore the kingdom of God on earth, which is Biafra. And it will definitely be restored. No matter what you think, no matter what you believe, we don't want to know. We are focused on the pursuit of our freedom. And freedom we must get very soon we are going to move into our own land so that you can have all the land to yourself. If, if you make us a citizen through your passport, good. It doesn't matter the planet where you are. An evil man will come there for his business. Peacefully, he will pay the price. He will pay the tax. Whatever you require, he will give and he will establish there. But he must have a home to return to. And that home is what we are fighting to build. Guide and protect everyone that have joined on this very broadcast from beginning to end. I will see you again tomorrow. May Chukwu Kukabiyama guide and protect all the Biafrans, all the Ududua people, all the Middle Belters, anyone that is genuinely seeking for freedom. Chukwu Kukabiyama will guide and protect you and secure you. May Chukwu Kukabiyama guide and protect our men on the ground, guide and protect the ESN, the Liberation Army, the BNL and BNG, everyone that is fighting genuinely for the freedom of Biafra. Chukwu Kukabiyama will guide and protect you and secure you. May Chukwu Kukabiyama guide and protect our media warriors. Guide and protect the Umuada, Honorable Azoka. May Chukwu Kukabiyama guide and protect her. Secure her and secure her family. May Chukwu Kukabiyama guide and protect our spokesperson, Master Simon Epa. May Chukwu Kukabiyama continue to guide and protect him. Give him 8,000 men wisdom, 10,000 men wisdom. Continue to protect him. Build a wall of fire around him. No weapon, spiritual or physical, in shall be the him. We commit our Supreme Leader Mazen Nande come into the hand of Chukukabiyama. May Chukukabiyama guide and protect our Supreme Leader Mazen Nande come 
Continue to guide him, protect him, secure him. Continue to give him good health. Give him more revelation. Give him more inspiration. Continue to reveal things to him. Send doctors spiritually to continue to minister to him. Give him strength, waxing strong much more. Chukwu come and bring him back to us very, very soon that we might be able to raise the flag with him. Thank you so much for watching wherever you are watching from. No weapon formed or fashion against the Biafran people shall prosper. No weapon formed or found or fashion against our spokespersons shall prosper. No weapon formed or fashion against Mazen Nandekan shall prosper. Thank you so much for watching wherever you are watching from. And remember, see you tomorrow. Bye bye.